and welcome to my video. So today I have a home bargains haul. So I have just one bag, this one here, it's pretty heavy. But yeah, just one bag today. It's mostly uh, cleaning products, maybe even new in cleaning products or new to me. Um, so I'll just get into it. I'll just do it in randomly. I'll put the bag up here on the table and just pull them up as I go along. So first, all, first of all, I have uh, the pink stuff because I have run out of this, so I'm just replacing it, and this is really good. I think everyone uh, knows about the pink stuff and uses pink stuff. This is just 99 pence, and it's amazing. You can clean anything with this. And then I have, this is open because I had to use it because I've been on two shopping trips, two home bargains, one last week and one today. So I had to use this last week, but I thought I'd still show it because it's really, really good. I used it to bake brownies last week and it's greaseproof paper and 10 meters. And this is only 79 pence. That's why I wanted to show it because I know some places the greaseproof paper can be really expensive. So I thought I'd show this. So if you're after greaseproof paper, look in home bargains because it's really, really good and cheap. Uh, next up we have, oh, this is one of the new things I have, a new cleaning product. Product. Um, it's Winter Sparkle and it's a Domestos thing to go in the toilet. No, a smelly thing to go in the toilet. And that's Winter Sparkle and it says it's with spiced orange and amber. So I think, oh, it says on there limited edition. So I think this is just out for Christmas and there's a few things in this range. Uh, so that's that, and they're 99 pence. And then I have this, a Christmas uh, Febreze. This was my favourite one last year, so that's why I picked this one up. There was a couple that I liked last year, but this one was really, really good. So I'm going to get a couple more of these now before Christmas so I don't run out. And this one is a limited edition. It says they um, let it snow, let it snow, vanilla noir up to two times older eliminating powder uh, power which I think it, all the Febrezes are and yeah so if you haven't tried this one I would highly recommend it it's really really lovely uh, next up I have oh this is another winter sparkle and this is the surf washing liquid now I'll be honest the bottle is lovely um, and everything it looks really nice and festive however I tried this yesterday and I'm not impressed, unfortunately. It's, um, I mean, it smells quite nice. I just dropped some on me then. It smells quite nice in the bottle, but I just don't, it just hasn't got that lasting smell on the clothes. Like this dress I washed yesterday now, and there's, li there's literally no smell on it now. Whereas with my other uh, washing liquids, I always get a really strong scent on my clothes afterwards. So, I had high hopes for this, but unfortunately I'm not impressed. But I'm gonna wash my bed in today, so maybe I'll feel differently then, I don't know. But at the moment, I don't know. Looks lovely, but there we are. So next up, and from that same range, the Winter Sparkle range, I have the Sif Spray. So this is the Sif Multipurpose, kills 99.9% .9 of bacteria and viruses safe for food preparation areas. So again, like the washing liquid, I have tried this because this is one of the things I bought last week. And again, I'm not impressed. Lovely bottle, limited edition for Christmas, but I'm not impressed with it. It doesn't smell Christmassy, but I will continue to use it. I mean, it's not bad. It's, it, there's nothing bad about it. It just is just not very festive. I think with these two things, I was just expecting far too much from them and so far they disappointed me but there we are but I picked them up anyway so those are the winter sparkle range now I think there's another there's something else in the range but I didn't pick it up because I didn't need it unlike using it it's um, a safe product again but it's the the cream cleaner so there's four things in that range and I mean with this I just wish they brought out a fabric softener and the um the scent boosters and I think then maybe I'd feel differently about it but I don't know I didn't know what um fabric softener to pair it with so I just used it on its own and I'm I'm not not impressed uh so next up we have just Dove soap I always buy this I don't know why I just restock this all the time it's just two bars of Dove soap and it's the 
the one with the Shea butter in and they just 99 pence for two. So today I picked up these 24 suction hooks. These were only 49 pence, so I thought that was a bargain because you, I just thought in case I need them to hang up, um, so if you can see it properly there, I just thought I may want to hang up some Christmas decorations with them. These would be handy for hanging a wreath on your front door if you don't want to put a hook over because I know with my wreath on my front door there's no way I'm putting a hook over it. I've got quite a new composite door and I think well, their metal hooks would maybe scrape it. So I've tied mine to my knocker but not everybody's got a knocker so if you wanted to put a wreath on the door and don't have a knocker to tie it to I think these are really good. Somebody recommended suction hooks for putting wreaths on your front door. So next up I have the a festive Zoflora. I can't get my words out today. And um, this is frosted peppermint and this is one of the large ones which are £3.99. So I'm gonna give it a little sniff and um, being careful while I do so because obviously you don't want to get this on your skin. It's really hard to open. Okay, that's really, that's got a real alcoholy smell to it. I can smell the mint and it does smell really nice. I think when it's diluted, that's gonna smell really lovely. But at the moment, it smells really alcoholy. And I can't think, can't think which alcohol that it reminds me of. But anyway, oh, it's got candy canes on there and it's peppermint, so it's gonna smell minty. But yeah, so I got that and it's a large one. They didn't do the smaller ones in this. I would have got a smaller one, I think, if they had them. So that's three ninety nine, and then next up I have. Oh, I'll get this up first. A Zoflora um, so disinfectant mist. I couldn't find the name of it then. So this was, I think this was one pound forty nine, and I've never tried this one before. I normally use the Fabulosa Lemon one, but I thought I'll try this one because this might be a bit more autumn winter me, autumn wintery autumn slash wintery um and this one is in midnight blooms and i've not smelt it i have had the zoflora you know one of these in in this smell and it's absolutely lovely so i think i will be happy with this and i just usually spray this on my rug on my um my my door handles my drawer handles on my kitchen and my sofa just to give them a freshener so I thought I'd try that. So that's new to me. I think they knew anyway, but definitely new to me. So next up, I have... Oh, I couldn't get up the bag then. So I have a 3Volution plug-in, a Febreze plug-in. And I have this... Oh, I bought the wrong one. I bought this in Cedar and Oak, where I wanted to buy it in... In that flavour, in the Let It Snow. Oh, that's so silly of me. So I don't really know what this smells like. But never mind. This was £4.49 and it comes with the actual plug and the refill. I mean, I've got another one of these in my hallway um, with a nice scent as well. But I thought I'd get another one. Um, oh, I'm so disappointed. I thought I got it in the other flavour. But never mind. I'm sure this is lovely as well. And like I said, that's £4.49. These last ages, by the way. It says 90 days, um, up to 90 days, but I think they last longer than that. And so that's all of the cleaning products and the non-food items. So next I just have a couple of food items and then I'm done. So first of all, I got some McVitie's milk chocolate digestives. I love these. And this is quite a big pack and these are normally quite expensive. They're only 99 pence in home bargains so I'll ask how much they were today so I thought I'd pick some of those up then I have some oh that's all gross that box so I have some skinny whip bars these are 99 pence and double chocolate snack bars and these are only 99 calories and I'm some shape doing slimming world and I think these are quite low in sins. I'm gonna have to check. But last time I did Slimming World, I think they were they were about five and a half sins, and they're quite um, substantial. So I bought them to try them again because I've not had them for ages. And then as a treat, I'm just preaching that I'm on Slimming World, but I bought myself some pork scratchings as a treat. 
and these were I think 49 pence and I don't know how many sins are in these I mean they'd be through the roof but I'm gonna have them over the, over the weekend as a treat and then last but not least I have a pack of chew it's I think there is are there six packs in here and these are I think for the, for the whole pack I think they're only six sins on Slimming World or six and a half possibly um, but they're really good. So if you want something sweet on Slimming World. And these last quite a while. There's loads in a pack. Just have a pack of these. So yeah. And they were 99 pence I think. And they're really nice. So that is all I have in my home bargains haul. I was hoping to get more. I thought there'd be some nice. Um, maybe some homeware bits. And some nice Christmas bits that I wanted. But there's nothing there yet in my local home bargains. Um, so that's it for today. So I hope you've enjoyed and I hope you like some of the stuff I've got and want to go and get some for yourself. And thanks for watching.